Yeah, th thanks, Ross. Who the hell is Captain Morales? He should be here any time. I told Reva to stay here. Doesn't she ever do anything that anyone tells her to do? No. Maybe she's out for a walk or something. She wouldn't have gone without leaving a note, Rusty. Unless she had no choice. No, we don't know that yet. We, we do, do know, know that. that. We do know that. Capitan Morales to see you. Good. Captain Amigos, I heard you down the hall. You sounded very upset. Yeah, we are. We have reason to believe that Solita Carrera abducted Miss Shane. Oh, so you told me over the phone. However, all the way here I keep thinking, why? Why would Miss Carrera do something so desperate? Captain Morales, I really don't care why. I just want to find Unless Miss Carrera right? had something to hide. Are your men out looking for her or what? Uh, take, for example, the incident at the conference or Mr. Spaulding's tragic shooting. Miss Carrera was responsible, wasn't she? Oh, I know you don't want me to know anything about this. But finally you call me because you need me. Because you know she, she's such a very dangerous woman. Stop it. Just shut up, please. I can't, Reva, please don't. What did you think I was going to do, kill you? As pleasant as that thought might be, some of us aren't made that way. Where the hell is Mrs. Ibarra? We're not all as drunk as you are, Reva. Do you mind if we don't talk? It's hard enough just being in the same room with you. I didn't mean to hurt anyone. I promise oh, I didn't. Oh, come on! Look, I said I wasn't going to hurt you. I couldn't take it anymore. I, just, I couldn't take it anymore. What are you talking about? All those months, everyone believed me, and I would look at you, and you knew. Damn right I knew. Oh, God, I wanted to stop. I didn't want you to know what kind of a person I was. I didn't want you to know what kind of a person I had to be. Had to be? Give me a break! You don't understand because you're so strong. You don't understand weakness and desperation. We are not talking about weakness here. We are talking about trying to kill Will. Hanging the rap on Josh. Shooting Alan. Oh, no. Then don't come to me mewling and puking about the fact that it had to be because I don't buy it, okay? I don't buy it. <laughs> I, I, I was looking out the window in the hospital. When they took Roxy away, I was looking out the window, and I thought, oh my God, I'm like her. I thought, I'm not right. Everybody thought I was so strong, and inside I was just being eaten away. I, I was so scared, and I felt so trapped. I was so ashamed, and I did bad things, Riva. Oh, my God, I did all those bad things, and I couldn't stop. I didn't want to. Don't, don't, don't you dare tell me this, please. If, if I could just go away, if I, if I could just go away like she did. Oh, Reva, for the love of God, please let me go. All I said was, I'd be happy to walk your dog, Miss Spencer. And suddenly, I was in business. Saturday, everybody called. Fifi, Tiny, Tulip. Mom said not to skip lunch. But Samson had to be at the beauty parlor by one. I went home to tell Mom. So she made me a sandwich and some a ride a mic 